first though, the time is 6.39. Looking at all those flooding problems, you're grateful that we're getting some sunshine right now. Yeah, we really, really needed it. So like you talked about earlier this week, it was terrible. Mm -hmm. Alex is talking about a lot of flooding problems and Faria just mentioned it too. Yeah, that's right. Monday was not a good recess day. I know no. that much <laughs> yes. uh, here in Central Georgia. Hey, two days ago, I went up to Jones County. We paid a visit to the fourth graders at Turner Woods Elementary School. We talked about a lot of things, tornadoes, hurricanes, and a really smart group up there asking a lot of questions about tornadoes, obviously, as we get into the spring severe weather season. So thanks to everybody up at Turner Woods Elementary there in Gray for having me out there on, uh, let's see, that would have been Tuesday afternoon. All right, let's check out the forecast this morning. Looking live in Dublin, temperatures are in the 30s right now, but we're headed to the 60s later on today. The satellite and radar shows some clouds around, but I expect those to quickly fade away as soon as the sun begins to come up. 37 in Macon right now, 43 in Warner Robins, 37 in Cochrane, 37 in Dublin, 39 over in Wrightsville, 38 in Forsyth, 37 in Thomaston, and 41 over in Butler. Here is the southeastern United States. You see the clouds become a little more dense once you get further down to the south. 40s and 50s off to the west this morning. That's kind of indicative of what we got coming our way by the time we get to tomorrow morning. So here Here's future view through the afternoon. We'll say low 60s by the noon hour headed to the mid to upper 60s later on today. A light breeze out of the southwest and then into the night tonight. Here comes that cloud cover and because that cloud cover is going to be around, we're not going to be able to cool off quite as much with temperatures in the mid 40s by 6 a.m. On into the afternoon, getting into the 60s once again. The first Mercer baseball game of the season is tomorrow afternoon and evening. Looks like we've got great weather for that, just not a lot in the way of sunshine. Temperatures on the warmer side of things. On into Saturday morning, looking for some scattered showers as a weak front slides through central Georgia. There's 8 a.m. there, and then notice for Saturday afternoon, we're not getting quite as warm. In fact, we're going to struggle to get into the 50s, I'm thinking, as we get into the afternoon hours, that is. Most of the afternoon spent in the 40s before the sun, or before, yeah, I mean, the sun will come out in the afternoon, but really before we clear out into the evening hours for Sunday afternoon and into the evening hours on Sunday. There's Monday afternoon there over into Tuesday. Still dry across central Georgia. There's Wednesday. Not much going on across the southeast. Let's talk about daylight. Today we've got 11 hours and two minutes of daylight. By the time we get to March 1st, that's going to be 11 hours and 31 minutes. So continuing to add a daylight onto each day and daylight saving time begins on March 10th, and that's when everything springs forward an hour, including those sunset times. Eight o'clock sunsets will be back by the time we get to the start of April. A warmer end to the week, 68 today, 69 for tomorrow. Tomorrow Saturday is going to be kind of one of those funky days where we are cooler in the afternoon, but I still think 59 is going to be the high temperature there. On into the uh, next week, we will begin a new warming trend back to 63 for Monday. So for Saturday, that 30% chance of rain will be around 58 there for Sunday. Pretty good weekend forecast, pretty good February weekend forecast kind of being spoiled here the next few days with 60s. 50s are is, uh, is a, a, a normal for this year, we'll say. 68 is what we're expecting for this afternoon. Heading home from work and school after starting off in the 30s this morning. Here's your seven day forecast 69 for tomorrow, 59 for Saturday, 58 on Sunday. Into next week, there's that new warming trend. 63 on Monday, 64 on Tuesday with more sun across central Georgia. We'll be back to 71 by the time we get to next Wednesday with partly cloudy skies.